Good afternoon, everybody. Sunday afternoon, and uh, Christmas has come early for me. This is from me to me. I don't know if you guys ever see these things. I bought one. This is one of those uh, mini chainsaws. I, uh, my dad had one, just got it, and uh, I was over at his house put in a gate a couple weeks back. And uh, I ran one of these things, I thought, well, you know, they're made in China. And I was kind of just thinking that, well, I don't know how good that, how good they're made. So I purchased one and uh, I was gonna kind of give you my, well, I wouldn't have purchased one how I did, if I didn't think that I liked it for one. And uh, it actually worked really well. So I was gonna kind of show you how it worked and uh, tell you a few things about it. If you're interested in getting one of these, it, uh, let's see here. This is my first time. I've actually used this a couple times out here. Works pretty slick. Nice trim saw. I'm not sure I would want to use it to, you know, take down a full tree, of course, but, um, Right now, what I'm doing is I'm tightening, ouch, tightening the blade up on it. There's a little screw here on the front, right down in here, and it allows you to tighten that up. There is no oil oiler for the chain. It runs, I guess, what you would call dry. I think that'll probably do it. So, stick the battery, stick battery in it. Just like that. Now, the kit that I bought came with the drill, it came with the drill, came with the little chainsaw, came with the uh, two 26 volt, I guess they call them batteries. And I actually, in my kit, I got two extra chains. So in total, I got three chains and I got the carrying case and basically their worthless instructions. This is made in China, so take it for what it's worth. But I was actually pretty impressed with it. It's got kind of a guard here. You don't have to keep it on. You can take it off, it has a little light, but uh, I was going to take it out. I'm going to see which one of these batteries is charged better than the other one. I was going to take it out and show you. Alrighty, well that one's not charged at all. So I guess we'll stick with this one. We'll see if I get any anything out of it. I'll go down to the, uh, I'll walk down to the tree line. Now, I think I'm going to just put a little WD-40 on the chain just to give it a little lubricant. They don't tell you to, but you're saying, well, if they don't tell you, then why would you? Well, I think it needs, I think it needs something. Of course, it goes dripping all over the place once I've done that, but all right. Well, I'm going to So I'll see if you can go with me here. So I bought the whole thing. I bought the whole kit, the carrying kit. And uh, I bought the whole thing, the carrier, the little 
kit, the chains and everything I bought it for just under 90 bucks off of a uh, eBay I think or Amazon I can't remember which but uh, it looks like um, it's a pretty good little unit I've cut a few things down with it just to try it out see what I actually thought of having it for myself and I must say I'm pretty impressed with this little item there was a tree down here that I noticed could use a little trimming so I'm gonna walk down here and see what we got just so I can show you what this is doing so here's a tree it's got a little a lot of little branches on it so I thought I would demonstrate this little saw stuff like this a lot of these are so just like that mm, she looks pretty nice I noticed the the battery life on it seems to be pretty good. Seems to last for quite a while. So, it does a pretty good job. It's about a one incher there. So yeah, I'm very impressed with this little thing. A lot of these little... I don't know... Use it for a... Basically what I bought it for is to kind of trim around the house some of the trees. You know, just like... But tell you what, it's a nice little saw. And just like that. How nice it does. You can get into you can get into places. You can get into places and, uh, you know, trim up. You don't have to carry the big saw around. So, yeah, if I was cutting a tree down and I was limiting it, would I use this? No. I would probably use my big saw because it's quicker. I can't reach that up there. So, not a bad saw for... 90 bucks like i said battery lasts for quite a while and uh yeah very happy with it i think that was a pretty good little buy what i did i would take it with me if i was cutting wood and such just because but um anyway so there you go. Looks like I forgot to tighten the nut when I tightened my chain. That's why I got movement there. Oh well. That's what I get for not reading my cheap Chinese instructions, I guess. So, anyway. So just kind of a little quick video on how that uh, works. And... Uh, that you guys like to see it it's a useful tool i'd buy one in a second highly recommend it so uh yeah anyway if you like these videos please share them with your friends share them with your enemies 
give me the thumbs up and uh, always your uh, comments are welcome. See you on the next one. Guess they're a little hungry. I'm a little late. Oh well, better late than never, I guess, huh? <clears throat>